Hello, let's play a bunch of daily word games. Today's bonus game is quadrigonal, which I haven't played in quite a bit. So we'll revisit that. So let's start with quads. All right, we have a U in place and an A in place. Hmm. Let's work on the word with the A in place because I think we'll have an easier time using common letters. So maybe like T-R-A something, track would be good. I'm trying to see, a train is even better. Okay. Um. Let me think about this right for a little bit longer. R A T something or R A something T. Hmm. It could be R A T E, like great. Um, crate. So more than one option, and we're not going to get much info from the guess. So let's look at the left word. I'm thinking maybe nutty. Uh, it doesn't help us with great or crate. Is there a word we can guess that would help with that? Um. Is there? Yeah, like butch. Oh, but that doesn't use the N. And nutch isn't a word. Um, okay, I don't know. Well, well, maybe nutty's not the answer, and then I'll, I'll get some more info and think of what to do. Nutty is the answer. Okay, well, now we're just stuck with great or crate. Let's start with crate because it's alphabetical. Nice. All right, alphabet wins. <laughs> a nutty crate. Crate full of nuts. Could be worse things to have in a crate. All right. I think I did pretty well. <laughs> Three and four. All right. Let's play Fibble. So each guess has a single lie in it. So that means this B might not be green. It might be gray or yellow. Uh, or maybe this gray, G, is supposed to be green. You never, you don't know. But one of them is lying. I think I'm going to have a hard time bringing in one of the grays. Now, B is the least common of the three that is has positive info, and green is less common than yellow, but also B does like to be at the start of words. So I might be able to do something with that. Seems tough, though. Like, I could guess something like um, blonde and omit the U, and that'll at least try to get a contradiction on the, on the B at the start. Perfect. That's what I wanted. So... We have a contradiction on the bees. This says there's a bee, this says there's not. So that's one of our lies. So we only get one more lie. That means that these O's can't both be lying, which means there is an O in the word. Now, one of them could be lying, and it should have been in place. But So I'm just going to assume there's no B at this point, and maybe there is a U in that case. There would have to be. Um, maybe, it, maybe it's lying, and we're supposed, to do o, uh, we're supposed to do O U like this. Let's come up with a word. And then we'd have to use the N. Um, o U N is a weird ending, though. Oh, you know what I want to do? I want to do clown. Oh no, what? that doesn't work because the L and the O are lying. Um, my my lie was going to be that the the O is supposed to be in place there, because I mean otherwise I guess we could do an O N word, and then bring in a U, and then we'd have to have use the uh, the L or the D. That doesn't look very good, does it? Hmm. What if I did start with B again? What would that mean? That would mean I'd have to use the O, U, and uh, no, sorry, I'd have to use the O and the N again. Um, and then, oh, I, mean, I can't put the O second though. So something like this. Two lies. No, something like this. Oh, I want to do buxom, but then I'm not. I don't actually have a lie. Oh no, buxom has an M anyway. Uh, I'm not sure there's a word for this. Think about BR, BE, bison, bison. Bison works. Okay, so we have this contradiction. Oh, we know this O is lying because we know there has to be an O. That's perfect. Okay, so there's no B. That B is lying. There is an N. This N could still be lying. Maybe it was supposed to be green there, but unlikely. Um, well, I don't know. We don't actually know. Maybe it starts with SN and then SNO, and that gets us our lie for the second word. But then we would. Oh, yeah, so something like stout works perfectly. Oh, and that is the answer. Nice. I think that was a good solve. I enjoyed that one. And I got it in three guesses, which is always good. <laughs> but uh, yeah, the lines were interesting today. Uh, it, was, it was fun trying to keep using the B and see if I could get away with that. And, and using those contradictions was helpful. I did fish out that this O, this was a very lucky lie because I knew that there was an O. So this had to be a lie. And then that cascaded and got me all the info I needed. Very cool. All right. How'd you do? Let's play between all. Start with mouse. 
Okay, so we're near mouse. This eight is telling us we're 8% near, and this orange dot, you can see it's near the top of the line. So we're 8% away from mouse, 37% away from the end of the dictionary. So hmm, jumping forward from mouse, maybe we could do something like rouse, see, see between the M and the R maybe. Yeah, it is. Okay, we went way too far. Um, I should probably get a better instinct on how far 1% is away from M, but anyway. Um, okay, so we're about halfway between mouse and rouse. So I'm thinking starting with O or P. Um, I guess we could split the difference right now and just go with P, but an early P, like um, Panda. All right, we didn't go. We went a little bit too far away from Rouse, so we're one point nine percent away from Panda. So we're probably still starting with P, but let's see. Maybe maybe Piano would be a good guess. That's too far. Ooh, but not by much. Now PIA is going to be hard to get something right before that. So I'm thinking we're actually not PI. Maybe we're PH, like phone. Maybe. Ooh, I went too far. Ooh, but not by much. I think PHO is still good. Ooh, but what, what else? What goes after phone? I mean, we could do... F okay, so phony is definitely a word, but I think that's a little bit too close to phone. Despite being 3% away, that's one or two words. But let's, let's test that. I don't mind testing that. Okay, so we need one word after phony, so it's not going to be P-H-O-N. Is there any other... Yeah, photo would be possible. Is there anything before photo? I don't think P-H-O-O -O works. Q doesn't work. R doesn't work. I think it is. I think it might be photo. It is photo. Wow. There's only one word. There, there's no words between phony and photo. That's kind of nuts, given how many letters there are between N and T. Cool. Well, I got it in seven. How'd you do? All right, let's play polygonal. We're in Hexpert to start. Um, so those symbols on the top tell us which letters repeat. So we have a we have a seven letter word today, and these repeat and these repeat, kind of like a sandwich. Let's look at ing. This is a little bit annoying. Um, I think knitting definitely has two t's. Um, we'd probably have to be a vowel at the start. Yeah, that this maybe maybe niving actually niving I think works. Okay, well, it's all gray, so it wasn't an ing word. Uh, it was worth a shot. Um, let's try er. We can end in like ers. Um, pre preserve. This is not does not say preserves. <laughs> um, ooh, oh, we re. I'd want a v here again. Um, I like pre, but I can't actually think of a letter to put here. Predators, premers, pressers, preppers, <laughs> brewers. No, oh, brewers. Brewers works. Wait, that was it. Oh, wait. <laughs> what? It's brewery. Okay, I thought I got it. Whew. That was quite the quite the solve there. All right, what's our 17 words were possible of ordinary words, that is. Preterm. So pre, I could have done preterm. Brewers and brewery. Aniline, granary. Interesting. Revives and revived. I went with niving. <laughs> okay. Well, let's do the mini. All right. So this middle letter repeats. So um, what should I do? Stats, I think, is a good one. Oh, no. We can't do stats. Uh, we could do state. Nothing. Okay. It might be a vowel that repeats here. I loves to repeat like this, um, but usually it, it comes with another repeat. Um, civil. Okay. <laughs> Let's try another vowel repeating here, like motor, but we can't do motor or mover. Uh, what, what goes OO though? Oof. Honor does. All right, finally some letters. Um, interesting result. Probably something like... Oh no, is it this? No, okay, it wasn't that. Um, boron? Okay. That was a nail-biter. Nice job. 
Uh, 480 words match the pattern, 153 ordinary. Yeah, it's, I think it's the it's one of the less common with one repeat, if not the least common with one only run repeat. Cool. Well, how'd you do? All right, let's play Quadragonal. We'll play all four difficulties. Um, I'm not going to shy away from the hints. I think the hints are fun. All right, so let's just immediately get crossword clues because I, I really like the idea of the crossword clues. Um, I'm going to adjust my... Uh, no, I'm not going to adjust my capture. It'll be fine. Um, so three down is so be it. Maybe amen. And then six across is summit. Um, summit. Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, what, what would this be? We can do SWAT. But summit. Um, okay, this is stab and tame. Oh no, we can't use the T again. Interesting. Slab and lame then. Um, summit. How about this? It, it, can't, it can't be tent because we already used the N. Um, actually, what letter goes there? Um, huh, I can't think what letter goes here because it can't be an N. N is already given. Could it be a vowel? See, we already used the A, so it can't be T-E-A-T. -T. Can't be T-E-E-T. -E Q-W-R. Tept? Is tept a word? No. D, F, I might as well just type them. H, J, K, L. Telt is a word? That seems a little wrong, though. Text. Ooh. Oh, an apex. There we go. And spat and pape. Ooh, what's pape mean? Okay, well, let's, let's move on to the, um, to the medium. All right, we got crossword clues again. I'm going to use them. Down to where the heart is. Home. And five across. Hefty read. A tomb, a tome. It's a hefty read. Nice. Okay. So now from here, this is going to probably be an S because I have to go before a T and an H. And it goes at the end of that word. Could this be stop and peas? I don't know if we'd want to end. What's this? Omit. Uh, and this is probably shop. Oh. It's not ship because we already used the I. Oh, we can't use the O. Ooh. Um. Huh, what got me this P? I think I just thought it was P. It works. Uh, if this, but this has to be omit. So. Can't use the O. A. I don't think shop is a word. It's not. A of A, E, I, O, U. Only O and I work. I don't see anything else working other than omit here. Tome is definitely right for a crossword clue. Um, and then two down home is definitely right. So the M and the T are basically locked in. But that's all we know. So ST, I think, is guaranteed as well. Maybe the P is wrong. So this could be a mid. Um, is that, yeah, mid is a word. SHA what? Uh, it's not P is the problem. I guess I could just try words, uh, letters here. F, G, J, 
Okay, it needs to work for both of these though. Let's and shall? No. C, V. Vets is a word, but not shav or vet. Yeah. How, how are we doing this? I like sham and meds, but not stom. Oof. I really feel like P is the only one that works. But then we'd have to do ship. And then omit just, I don't know what omit would be. Does another vowel work here? A. I O U? No, it doesn't work. We have to put an I here. That's forced. I need another hint. Let's update the keyboard. Okay, so M I W is used somewhere. There we go. Got it. We had Shaw and Stowe and Weds. I didn't think about the W there. Very nice. I mostly had it right. I just couldn't think of the W going there. And I thought this was, this was oh, this is omit. I wasn't sure what this was. I, I think amid was something I thought of. Anyway, OK. Let's do the hard. More crossword, nice. Caused to go, four down. Caused to go. I mean, I, I thought of went, but actually, I don't think went means caused to go. How about seven across? Method of verification. Hmm. What are the other hints? I can reveal a tile. I'm not sure what caused to go or method of verification is referring to right now. Um, is there anything obvious that I could fill? We could figure out what, what uh, we could find vowels. So I'm assuming this is a consonant, but let's find out. I'm assuming this is a vowel, but let's find out. And how about this one as well? And then what fourth one? How about this one? That would be good to know if it's a vowel. Okay, apply apply hint. Okay, consonant, vowel, consonant, consonant. Okay. So the this is a vowel. So consonant before R. There's a lot that could work. Ooh, maybe I should have seen if this was a consonant. Um, I'm thinking about TR, PR, G yeah, there's a lot actually. I don't know if that helped. I could reveal a tile. What would I reveal? What's most like there's not like a super commonly repeated tile, but maybe this would help. But I, I feel like the crossword clue is already telling me about this word, which I might be able to get. And so revealing that doesn't make sense. So I want to avoid seven across and four down and real reveal something else, but maybe maybe this consonant would be a good reveal. Nothing else is really, maybe this one. Actually, we should reveal this one. Okay, P. Wouldn't be my first guess, so that's good that we got it. Um, I gotta get these crossword clues. Caused to go. No idea. Method of verification. Like IDing someone? Like or 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 testing test maybe? Ooh, test actually works. And then that makes this start with S. Sent. Cause to go. Sent. This is probably open. Pros open. Um what is this? Plot. And then lane and, ooh, is that the intended word? Oh, it was supposed to be an I. That makes sense. Line and ripe. Okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> I, got a, I got an alternate solution on that one. Okay. Yeah, I, I is better. All right, let's do the, the expert one. Um, oh, I think we're always getting crossword made now. I, I, I think I gave feedback that I really like the crossword, so I'm glad we always get that. Method of verification again. Okay, well, I know what that is. Uh, it's test. Wow, that gives me a bunch of letters. Seven across, chair or stool is a seat. Okay. So what goes here? S something AS. Oh, this is area. No, this isn't areas. Maybe apes. I can see apes being a word. Spas and spat. Oh, that works really well. 
uh, pipe, I guess. And then this is area. Oh, I think we got pape again. No, we didn't. Pope. Oh, shoot. Yeah, there we go. Pope and poor. Nice. Getting the crossword clues uh, uh, really helps. <laughs> cool. Well, I hope you enjoyed these. Um, and uh, yeah, let me know how you did. Let's do symbol. Start with blaze. Okay, we think there might be a B at the start, so we'll try that with bound. There's not. Now I think there might be an L at the start. Need all new letters. I could do limit. I wonder if there's a way to not repeat letters. Um, lyric is fun. Let's do that. It does not start with L, but ends with... Maybe ends with R. Maybe ends in Y. Maybe ending in Y would be good. So we start with an A or an E. Whatever we start with, we can't use the other. A something 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 Y is my initial thought. Like a say. Whoa. Out of nowhere. <laughs> I love it. I mean, there, I think we were down to not much. It'd be interesting to know, but. Cool. That worked out well. <laughs> my instincts were right. Let's do the blind fusel. Uh, we're going to get a lie. Um, I mean, I guess a say might catch a lie. Let's find out. It did not. It colored... Oh, no, it did. There's a lie between these A's. Uh, probably no A in the word, unless there's two. But you can't have this be gray and that be yellow. So we know there's an S. There are plurals in this game, so I'll try S at the end. Um, I mean, probably no A. So let's get all new letters, like... I don't know. <laughs> lots of lots of options. Um, how about tomes? That sounds fun. All right, it does not end in S, but it ends in a letter close to S. But it's not E R. Okay, we, we we might start with S then because that's near T. And then this is an O, so S what? This is near O. S P or S L. Let's try S L. And then we need to end in R or T or P. We're only going to get greens, which is really unfortunate. Um, could I do like... Oh, can I do sport? Oh, this can't be an O. Darn. Um, spurt, then. Spurt is spelled with a U. I don't know why I spelled it with an I. I could have had it in three. <sighs> My spelling strikes again. <laughs> just a, a brief moment of just putting, thinking about that word wrong. And I got in, in, in four instead of three. Oh, well. Still a good solve, I think. Uh, okay. Let's play Don't Wordle. It's thinking of a secret word. We're trying not to guess it. So I'll start with kayak. Ooh, a fourth is nasty. Um, I'm going to undo it. I don't really want to do put this much thought into this final game. So um, we're just going to go straight to Xylil and hope for the best. There's an L. Of course there is. Um, probably L second is our way to go. Um, something like Blood would be fine, I think. What was it? We had an A fourth, so. Okay, we probably end in AL, to be honest. Um, I could do something like Civil. It's not bad. It's going to put... Oh, no, the L can't go at the end, actually. It's not AL. So L is either here or it's here. And there's one of them. Um, how about Lilac? Um, we, we know there's an A fourth. I don't want to lock that in. Um. As long as I avoid the A as long as possible, we're good, but something like limit might be good. Let's try that. So we do start with L. Um, something like lunch? I don't know. That's a lot of common letter, uh, a lot of unique letters. Um, is there like an L-U-L-U -L -U Luxor? <laughs> um, lupus? 
unfortunate. All right, L U. Our word is L U something A. Okay, I think we can think of a word that uses an E. Is there an L U something E R word like lunar? I know lunar is usually spelled with an A R. In fact, that might be our answer. Lunar might be our answer. So let's avoid doing that much. Um. So maybe I don't want to end an R at this point. What I do with this LU <coughs> is really the question. Maybe lunch is good. I mean, if it's lunar, all right, I'll try lunch. I mean, I have to undo. It is lunar, but there's one more word that I can do. Maybe it's this word. No. Maybe L-U-N-E something. Um, <laughs> I'll try them all. G-J-K. There's only one other word, and I have to fish it out. But I feel like there's not many options. L-U-N-A something else other than R. That's always an option. I mean, if it's not L-U-N-E or L-U-N-R or L-U-N-A, what is it? L-U-N-N? -N? Maybe it's like L-U-N something A. That seems reasonable. I just need to fish this out and I win. <laughs> it always seems to come to this, doesn't it? So maybe something ending in E then. Q-E, W-E, double E, A-E. F E G E. Oh no, okay. It actually could have been lunge <laughs> this whole time. I'm lucky it was. Oh no, no, it couldn't have been because I knew A was fourth. Okay. Phew. Okay, I knew A was fourth. So lunge was safe. All right. From lupus. Luok. Luker. Luger. Lure. 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 <laughs> okay. Cool. Uh, well, those are the games for today. Hope you enjoyed them. And if you did, then why don't leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.